Good morning. Hi everybody. We're back. About to drop another video. video. I got my other ride or die with me today. Daddy is at work and we're coming to do some acupuncture. She just asked, does it hurt? I said, I don't know, but we about to find out. But I heard it's really good for like fertility and the IVF and helping with that. So I think this is gonna be good. It's gonna, it helps you sleep, it relaxes your muscles. It, um, it, it helps like the blood flow in the uterus. So we're gonna see how that's going. Yeah, sweet to me. So this is my recorder. You guys know how she is when she records. She be recording herself a lot. So I gave her a prep talk right now. So try to record the acupuncture session. If you want to show your outfit and your shoes, okay, but. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are headed up to elevator, second floor. Get this acupuncture pop. Let's see. An update, my swelling in my stomach has gone down a lot. I'm still a little bloated, but it's gone down a lot. I'll be starting my stomach injections to help it go down even more next week. Um, that's just gonna help even better. So, yeah. I'm thinking this is, is this it? I think this is it. Oh, this is cool. Okay, y'all, I am, got my acupuncture show it from the top stink you see the one in my head i think i got how many stink just one one and then one how many? in the ear the ear and then one over here mm -hmm. and then four over her stomach and then some of her legs and then one on each foot one she had three on this leg and three on that leg so the one in the foot you can feel like it's like a little tingling sensation almost, but let's feel one right here too. It just makes you feel really relaxed. We got our little shutters right there. It's not too bad. So these ones that are in my ovaries right here are gonna help bring my bloating down. It's gonna stimulate the blood flow. The ones that are on my foot are for stress, to help with stress. And then the ones in the ears are something she's on. I don't know, but it feels good. Brianna's next. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. I just do it on my I would just do it on my hand. Oh, she didn't put nothing in the seat? That is so crazy, huh? You can stop it whenever you want. You can do that. Look at that. She said, do you want one? <laughs> I said, no, y'all. She asked me if I wanted one. Okay. Black and gold. Black and gold. 
I do one of my own. I'm both of them. Yeah. One off the top of your head. Yeah. You don't want one on top of your head? Yeah. I don't hurt at all. I think we're supposed to sleep, but I'm not tired or anything. Oh, Alright guys, so we're getting in the elevator right now, but acupuncture is done. I feel really relieved. So she told me, ask, they ask you questions like about your health and how you feel and what are you struggling with. So one thing, obviously my ovaries are bloated, so she's working on that. Um, helping with my uterus to like get the blood flow and my uterus and my cervical area um, to prepare me for my embryo transfer when we transfer the baby back in. Also, I struggle with sleeping at night and then I get these like horrible night sweats um, from like sleeping from the hormone shots and the birth control and stuff. I sweat really bad at night and I have somewhat of insomnia where I can't even fall asleep and when I do, I wake up all times of the night. So I have really bad lower back pains too. So she told me to open my mouth, look at my tongue. If Because my tongue, at the tip of my tongue, it's kind of red and pink. She said she already knew that I was sleepy and tired. And then if it's pale, if it's pale, it means, what did it mean? If it's pale? It, pale, pale, pale it means that you're, you're um, tired. Thirsty or something? No, no, no craving. Something. Craving. craving. Oh, yeah, yeah. So if it's pale, that means you're craving something. Um, so she asked if I have any cravings. No, no, no. If your if your tongue is white and pale, that means that's asking if you wait, get the camera together. <laughs> that's asking if you have. You can put it on YouTube. I'm just saying you had it up. That's asking if you have like any cravings. I told her I don't have cravings. I get really thirsty at night, but I drink a lot of water. Um, but she could tell by my tongue that I'm very tired. And then because of my face, um, she says she can tell that I don't have a lot of energy, which is true. I've been very like drained and fatigued ever since starting the IVF in general, like my sleeping days and just my being drained and stuff and fatigue is just like, yeah. So I do feel relaxed. So once she puts the needles in and they don't hurt at all, it's a quick pop. And you guys will see that from the video, but once she does it, it doesn't even hurt. And then as you're laying there, it takes a while, but eventually you feel like this sensation through your body and it's just like shuts your body down and you're just like in a relaxed state so it was very relaxing i'll be back next week again the day of my when i transfer the baby in i'm gonna come before i transfer the baby and after i transfer the baby because they help get all of that together um, to help the baby implant and stick so yeah that was acupuncture so i guess we're gonna be uploading a couple other videos later on some stuff um just to kind of keep you guys in tune because i don't have another appointment until next week to go to my clinic brianna to go to my clinic so yeah we'll just do some stuff later today and then we will get all that popping and we're gonna do some pranks today some pranks today too yeah so we're gonna start adding some pranks just to kind of keep you guys entertained through the IVF channel. The time on this channel right all right so we will check you guys later peace, peace.